everybody, I'm Shuri, Policy Specialist for JFI APEC. Today we're at Lu's Hainanese Curry Rice that has been around here in Tiong Bahru, Singapore for more than 70 years. And today we're going to be trying their traditional curry rice but with a twist. So this looks and smells like the curry chicken rice that we all know and love. But the difference is that this fillet is actually made from cultivated chicken grown directly from animal cells. Which means that no chickens were harmed in the process. Mmm. It's good. The texture and the taste really tastes like chicken. It tastes like um this uh, chicken curry rice I used to eat in my primary school during recess time. Yeah, so it brings back a lot of memories of like running around during recess and like hanging out with my friends. So that's pretty nice. Nostalgic. Our traditional食物跟这个 whether it's in a Michelin star restaurant that's super fancy or in a hawker center which is where we're at today, everybody loves chicken. And now we found a much better way to make it. The challenge is today, part of it is only available in very small and limited quantities because the cost of production still remains far above conventional meat. And while what we tasted today could be the future of meat, the future is not inevitable. In order to sustainably feed our fast-growing population, enormous public and private funding is needed in order to scale up production and manufacturing. If we do that, Singaporeans and beyond can continue to enjoy their favourite chicken dishes without the negative and harmful effects on public health, animals and the environment. You should try it! <laughs>